Hello, John Neal here. Welcome to my little world. Uh, we're in lockdown again. Uh, can't really go anywhere. We take a walk around the streets. We just did that. And uh, hardly anybody about. A car went by. It was. Uh, we stopped and watched as it went by. That's how bad things are getting. However, this afternoon, great excitement. The wood, the uh, firewood is turning up. Have a delivery of about a ton of it. So it'll pass 15 minutes of your time and probably a couple of hours of mine getting it all sorted out. I tell you what, I'm going to play a little game with you um, because uh, a number of things will occur in this and uh, I'll try and get past you as many uh, falsehoods, fake news as I can. Bits and pieces. You can see if you can spot what they are eh, as we go. The wood that I've got, is it, this is all I've got left. It's under here. And uh, there's no more than that. And some of it is a little bit damp, so I've had to stand it uh, by the fire overnight, actually, just to get it finally dried off. And, and that seems to work quite well. So that's all I've got left. There's a little bit under there, but I'm going to stack it along here. You'll see me do that in a while. Okay. Just got to wait for it to turn up now. It's going to be wet because today it's drizzling it's about it's not cold i've only got my jumper on i'm okay um it's about four or five degrees i think and it's drizzly and gray horrible oh. funny enough we set out the other day for a walk and it was like this and when we got to the part where we walked it was brilliant loved it fantastic um so uh let's see how wet it is when it turns up and uh I've got to shift a ton of wood. So I've had a good lunch. I'm ready to go. So who wants a wheelbarrow joke? Oh, lots of you, great, okay. Man goes in a building site and gets a job as a labourer, just hoiking all the bricks and cement around, usually with a wheelbarrow. And uh, he works for a few hours and he goes to the foreman, he says, foreman, he says, this wheelbarrow's no good. The it, it, it needs oil and it, it keeps going. And the foreman says, get your cards, mate, you're sacked. He says, what for? He says, that wheelbarrow should be going. <laughs> <laughs> There's uh, three methods for putting this wood up. This is the hand-to-hand -hand method. One hand, other hand, on. One hand, other hand, on. There's the more energetic one, which is the two hands at a time. Two together go. Two together go. Then if you're really fed up, you just put one hand on there and then you just do them 
one at a time. Actually, no, you should left hand on your knee, bend down one at a time, steady rate. These are all contained in the uh, firewood picking up handbook published in uh, 1863. Actually, well before the, the uh, invention of the wheelbarrow, so I don't know how they managed that. Ah. Actually, the wheelbarrow is invented by the Chinese. They seem to have invented everything. Here's the thing the Chinese are so clever at inventing things fireworks, writing, paper, wheelbarrows. How come they never invented the fork to pick up rice? Let's have a couple of sticks. In 1871 there was a bylaw passed in England saying that wheelbarrows must be pushed full and pulled empty. The song Norwegian Wood, written by Lennon McCartney and sung mostly by John Lennon, was originally called This Bird Has Flown. Well, it took me ages to do all that, which is great because I've got ages to do things. This lockdown is getting a bit um, tedious, but hopefully vaccines are on the way and what have you. Let's hope we all stay safe and uh, survive. So, um, well, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, slightly crazy, but uh, all good fun. Um, this stuff is really quite damp. It'll take months to dry out. I've got some to be going on with, don't worry. So until next time, stay safe and I'll see you soon. Bye bye. Mind you, I'd heard that some poor devil had been playing percussion on his teacup. How mad is that? I've got bits in me tea now. Ah!